Hi there. So uh, today we're going to do a video uh, review of a tripod I bought for my little fleet of GoPro type cameras. I guess I should start calling them action cameras because they're really not GoPros. So I bought these Sabrent uh, flexible tripods. I, I bought four of them for about six dollars a piece. And uh, let's see what we got here. So there is, it's a little tripod that uh, can be hooked around stuff. So if I wanted to, I could, you know, adapt it to go around something. Hmm, I'm actually pretty impressed with that. It just grabbed a wall. So um, anyway, I, I bought these because I often need to um, manage my uh, GoPro cameras and, and I don't always want them on uh, me or something else. So it comes with a mount that does not look like it will actually work. That's really frustrating. Hmm. All right, maybe it has a manual too because it isn't gonna mount to that. Uh, so the removable screw here. All right, RTFM. All right, so this screw comes off. So let's go ahead and remove that. More like what we're looking for. And I'm gonna be using my Apeman A66 action cameras. If you're curious about these, check out the review. Um, some of my footage today will be shot with these. And they are very compatible with GoPro in terms of the accessories and the mounts. So I've got them in their little mini case. They weigh about 50 grams, so they're super, super lightweight. So I really could do something like this. I'm not sure that's vibration proof, and I almost guarantee you the camera would not survive the fall, but this is still pretty cool. Um, this camera was $39 and came with probably $40 worth of accessories, and a set of two batteries with a dedicated charger was another $12. Um, it's not perfect, but it is a great little camera for the bargain. All right, it's a great or I should say it's a great bargain for the money.